This is the M Zoo face mask. It's like some random brand, but they got something right because this is ultimately very, very comfortable. It is the best eye mask I have ever worn. I got one from Delta Airlines. This is the free ones that you get. And you basically wear these and you toss them away. They are disposable, which to me is a real big waste. So I actually bring them home and then I just reuse them. I put them on, right? These are the typical ones. And it's just one basic piece of fabric and then there's two little as elastic thing that ties around. And the drawback with these is that it puts pressure on your eyeballs. When this is on your face, you can't actually open up your eyes because when you open it up, you can feel that the fabric is touching your eyeballs, your eyelashes are kind of brushing up against it. Maybe sometimes they might even touch your eyeballs. When you're sleeping, you're not actually, you know, opening up your eyes. You have them closed, right? But right before you sleep, yeah, sometimes you have your eyeballs open even though you have your eye mask on. And this is a really uncomfortable thing. So when I wore this one, I was like, wow, it's actually very, very comfortable. Wearing the old ones, I would probably wake up, you know, two, three times a night trying to readjust this thing so that it stays on my face. But with this one, I just put it on, I go to sleep, and I don't even realize that it's on until the next morning. So there's a huge quality of life improvement if you move to something like this. So let me zoom in on this and show you what's included. It comes in a box like this and they seem to take pride in their packaging coming with this little piece of paper. This was actually in a little baggie, but I removed it already. It comes with a little bag, you know, like a travel bag with their logo proudly written on top. I would prefer if they don't put their logo everywhere though. And it does come with a medium density earplugs. They feel like they would block off a lot of sounds. But the main attraction here is the eye mask itself. You have the adjustable headband. You adjust it so that it won't wrap around your head too tightly. But if you look at a lot of other eye masks, it won't have a relief point right here for the foam because you want this to fold around and if there's a lot of foam over here, it's going to scrunch up and kind of come up right here and it's going to put pressure right in the middle of your forehead. So that's a pressure relief point. And if you fold this up, you can see that it very evenly distributes the weight across your entire face, except the eyeballs, which is the sensitive area. And this makes it feel like it's almost not there because there's so much surface area on your face that uh, well, this is very comfortable. And this is the front of it. It has a little thing. I chose the black one. There's different colors. The foam in it is this kind of soft memory foam. So it's going to kind of contour to your face and stay there. That's how it flexes. Let me put it in this bag to show you what it would look like in the bag. I assume you just fold it like this or you fold it this way. I'm not sure which way you want to fold it, but just kind of shove it in here. Yeah, I guess they want you to fold it in half and put it inside the little baggie. And there you go. There are other brands out there that looks exactly like this. And I've tried one other one and it's not exactly the same. It has no MZU brand over here, but when I put it on, my eyelash tended to touch the front of here when I'm blinking with the eye mask on. So I was like, yeah, this is kind of like it, but it's like a little bit off. So. If you're going to buy a pair of this, do look for the MZU brand and check out my affiliate link down in the video description below for the exact product. You need this if you're going to have a light on in the bedroom, if you are going camping because the lights come up really early, like five or six in the morning, and you really need one of these uh, when you go, you know, tent camping. When you put this thing on, my ears tend to be a little bit tall, but then this didn't bother me too much to put it over my ear because these bands are actually really, really wide and it was comfortable enough. It's not ideal. Um, it would have been nice if they have maybe two medium sized bands to go around my ears instead. Uh, but I think this is comfortable enough. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to give me a like and subscribe for more.